Hello, insiders. This is Todd back with another update and bringing Connor from Trust and Safety Team today to tell us more about uh, an update to the Help Center related to self certification. Connor, what's been happening in the self certification world? Thanks, Todd. So, some exciting things on our side. Um, over the course of rolling out self cert to everyone, uh, we've learned a ton about where creators can get tripped up by our policies, as well as acknowledging ourselves that they can be very nuanced. Um, so today we want to talk about a helpful resource for creators so that they can more easily navigate self-certification and get to know our policies more holistically as well. So how did you approach this uh, update? Where we started was really looking at the objective of self-certification. Um, and looking at this program, which we've launched, it's all about transparency. And that's exactly what we want to bring to this helpful article as well. So where we started was we looked at the uh, internal guidelines that we give our human review team. Um, and we looked at what summary could we provide to the creator community, surfacing key definitions that have long been asked for by creators. For example, how do you define nudity? Nudity means a ton of different things to a ton of different people. But this article really defines these key concepts and what they mean to YouTube so the creators can more accurately complete their questionnaire. So which creators would you recommend check out this new Help Center article? Well, ideally all creators, um, anyone who wants to know our policies better. This is the first time that any content-centered platform has been this transparent. The questionnaire has eight sections, uh, but they're only ever going to be a summary of all of the policy guidance that YouTube maintains. But if you're looking for who should definitely be reading this article, it's going to be especially helpful to creators with low accuracy. I see. So tell me more about creators who don't really see their content being reflected in the questionnaire. Yeah, so when I said uh, the questionnaire is only ever going to be a summary, um, it's eight sections with short options to help guide creators to the right ratings. Now, naturally, that's not going to be the full detail of any of the policies each section represents. And what we're really conscious of is that creators want to get it right, um, and that when they get it wrong, there can be a huge impact. And that impact is low accuracy, which means we trust your answers an awful lot less. Uh, so both in terms of accuracy and to ensure we're being transparent, we're going all in on transparency. Um, and really, this is only going to be the beginning um, of the publication of these guidelines. Uh, but we've quadrupled the word count. Uh, we've introduced these new concepts and definitions. So we're hoping it's going to be really helpful. Word count. I thought you said we've quadrupled the word can't. Yeah, it's the Irish accent really, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> we've actually uh, expanded the number of words on the page. So typically, what we've heard from creators is that we're never detailed enough, detailed the extent that they need when they're trying to forecast what monetization rating they're going to get on their content. So our quadrupling of the word count is a first step. And um, we've introduced a lot more guidance. Are you including all the details of the policy in this update? Yeah, so that's really important to call out. We're not there yet. Um, our policies are incredibly detailed. So we're working to translate them into really neat sentences. And we're planning on updating this article at least every two months, if not more frequently. Great. And uh, if creators have feedback about this or questions, what should they do? Uh, well, we're going to review all of the comments. So if you have any thoughts, good or bad, uh, leave a comment, and we'll review it. And who knows, you might see your own bullet point uh, represented in the next update. Uh, to this Help Center article. Great. Well, thanks, Connor, for coming on and telling us more about the details we're releasing around self certified to be more transparent. And uh, please leave your feedback. And uh, otherwise, keep it real. Thanks, Todd.